How's it going, everybody? It's Eon here, and welcome to a Metal Gear Solid movie news update. The following information comes from website We Got This Covered, who recently posted an article detailing a portion of their interview with Jordan Vogt Roberts, who was directing the upcoming Kong Skull Island, as well as the still in development Metal Gear Solid movie. When asked about the status of the Metal Gear Solid movie and whether he was still helming the project, Jordan provided the following statement. Metal Gear is something I've been attached to for a long time. It's a movie I fought tooth and nail to try and attach myself to because it is potentially the most precious property on this earth to me. And it is one of the most tricky and idiosyncratic properties on the planet where the creator's voice, Hideo Kojima, is a genius. It would also be one of the easiest properties for Hollywood to mess up. Luckily, there are very smart producers on it. It's the type of thing where it would be very easy for Hollywood to be like, oh, it's like Mission Impossible. No, it's not Mission Impossible. It's like G.I. Joe. No, it's not G.I. Joe. Metal Gear Solid is Metal Gear Solid and can only be Metal Gear Solid. It is an incredibly tricky thing to adapt because of how specific the tone is. Kojima's tone is so brilliant in what it does. The tone of this movie at times could take itself very seriously, be very intense, and then the next moment it can be very goofy and very sort of out there. There is no other property on the planet that I would want to protect and shepherd more than the Metal Gear Solid property. We are working on a script and have great producers. The goal is to get the script right and do justice to a movie that is unlike anything else that exists in movies or video games or anything. It's one of the most influential properties in my life, and I've been fortunate enough to get to know the creator over the last couple of years. Just to be able to spend time with him is great. I will say that Jordan at least has the right mindset, which is uplifting. Based on his statements, his love for the Metal Gear series seems legitimate, and he's also well aware of how Hollywood could completely mess up this endeavor, which means he'll actually try to do everything he can to fight against this notion. He also seems to understand just how difficult it will be to adapt something so unique like Metal Gear, even by video game standards. I get the sense that he isn't just jumping into this project for greed, but rather because he genuinely loves this series, wants to protect it, and cares about properly adapting it onto the big screen. He's very self-conscious about the task that he's undertaking here, and that is always a very good sign. Now, having the right mindset doesn't necessarily equate to a good movie. His statements certainly do make me more optimistic, but I still have my doubts that they'll be able to pull it off. It's just I've been burned too much by Hollywood's attempts at adapting video games into movies. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm pretty excited about the prospect of a good Metal Gear Solid movie, but part of me thinks that the Metal Gear series is one of the least movie-adaptable video game series. After all, it's the quirky and unique things that Kojima does with the interactive nature of video games combined with the cinematic storytelling that makes Metal Gear, Metal Gear. The way players can interact with the Metal Gear games play an equally pivotal role as their story. They're two sides of the same coin. By adapting the series into a movie, you're kind of losing one side of that coin. But who knows, maybe Jordan will surprise us. His heart is certainly there, and maybe he'll find a way to make it work, maybe he'll find a way to implement Kojima's quirky humor while still somehow maintaining that unique Metal Gear Solid tone and unique approach to storytelling, and maybe, just maybe, he'll find a way to keep Hollywood's filthy paws away from the project so that the team can flex their creative muscles and tackle this project without corporate interference. It's a tall order, but hey, at least Jordan seems to be aware of what he signed up for, and he seems to genuinely care about making this a success. We'll see what happens. All in all, I'm cautiously optimistic about the project. What are your thoughts on Jordan's statements regarding the Metal Gear Solid movie? Are you excited about the prospect of a movie adaptation of this beloved game? Do you think Jordan will be able to pull it off, or do you expect that we'll get another subpar Hollywood adaptation? Let us know in the comments below, and and to be further updated on all things Metal Gear Solid, stay tuned right here on Yong Yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Yong out.